Hey guys, do you want to know how much I make on italki? By the way, this video is not sponsored by italki or anybody. I just want to share my progress with you because in the beginning of the year, italki posted a progress report of me as a teacher and me as a student. So I want to share with you this progress report. By the way, if you don't know what italki is, italki is a platform where language learners can meet language teachers. So if you guys are interested in learning languages, I'm going to leave a link in the description below. All right. I want to start out by telling you why and how I started teaching on italki. So it was six years ago that I started learning Turkish and in Thailand, there weren't any teachers around to teach you personally. So I had to find a way to get a teacher to learn Turkish. And I found my teacher online on this website. So my first teacher ever was a Turkish teacher. So after two months of learning with a Turkish teacher on italki, my teacher asked me, why don't I teach on italki? So at first I was like, no, I cannot teach because I don't have any experience teaching. And um, just is, teaching is not for me. I thought so. So I feel like I was being challenged by my teacher to teach. And I was also thinking that if I earn money from italki, I can use the money that I earn to buy courses so I can take more classes. So that's why I decided to teach on italki. So for the first three years, I only taught three languages. That was Thai, Korean, English. The fourth year, I started to teach Chinese. And then right now I'm teaching six languages on italki, which are Thai, Korean, English, Chinese, French, and Spanish. So in the year 2022, I taught more than 500 classes to more than 100 students. As you can see in 2022, I earned almost $13,000 by teaching these six languages. The Portuguese that is written there, actually I'm not teaching Portuguese. So in total, during these six years of teaching languages on italki, I've made almost $47,000. And I wasn't teaching full time. In the beginning, I was working in a company too. So I only teach in the morning before work and one hour after work like that. And even this day, I'm teaching only two to three days per week. So that comes out to around $25 that I made per class. So the languages that I taught the most in the year 2022 up to now is Spanish and French, which are the two languages that I've learned quite recently, around five years ago. So I want to show you that if you put in a lot of time, if you really dedicate yourself to learning, you get to a level where you can even teach the language in a few years. And by the way, I have videos that I talk about how to learn Korean from scratch, how to learn French from scratch. And I also have my Thai channel where I dedicate my channel to teaching Thai language. So if you guys are interested, I'm going to put the link below in the description. And as you guys might already know, my native tongue is Thai. So all the rest of the languages that I speak and that I teach, so all these five languages that I teach, they're not my native tongue. According to this, I spent 51 hours teaching Korean in December. I don't only teach on italki, but I also learn on italki. So in the year 2022, I learned French, Indonesian, and Turkish from this site. According to this, I spent 1,110 hours learning on italki. And of that, I've spent 840 minutes with my favorite teacher, Rachel. So I don't claim to speak French really well and teach and that's it, but I still have to improve because anyways, I'm not a native speaker. I still make mistakes and I also have to improve a lot because learning languages, in order to get to the top level, if you ever get there one day, it takes years. It takes more than 10 years, I think. And in December, I took four classes and French classes with Retro. So according to Aitaki, I'm a polyglot powerhouse, although I don't know what that means, powerhouse. So as you guys can see, now I can already speak 11 languages and that doesn't come from nowhere. I invested a lot of time, a lot of money. I teach a lot to maintain my languages. 
So if you guys are interested in learning languages, I really recommend italki. I think it's a very good learning platform and I use it a lot to practice speaking and to maintain my languages. Alright guys, thank you so much for watching and I'll see you guys in the next video.